Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Sparkle Plays, the new Snow Place Like Home, just released today. So, let's uh, continue with our adventure, shall we? Let us go. Oh, that famous loading screen. Mm-mm-mm. I haven't missed you. Oh dear. Oh, little one's crying. Um. Nope, I'm I'm sleeping. Sorry, can't help you. It's your turn. Cram, wake up. <laughs> Pizza flavored jelly beans. <laughs> oh yum. I'm asleep. I'm asleep. I'm asleep. You ain't fooling anyone, love. So asleep, so asleep, so asleep. <sighs> Come on, Graham won't Stay fall asleep. for that, will he? I'll check oh, on Lord. The okay, fine. Maybe he will fall for it. So, wow, wow, okay. There was a lot of toys everywhere. Oh, hello. Cloth diapers. Every father's dream. Well, I hope not. Or right, get what about this milk formula? Their palates can taste the difference, I'm told. Taste the utmost difference. So it's... Ooh. <laughs> okay, what's with this thing? It's getting pretty crowded with all this baby stuff. Yeah, baby bottles. Let's go see the little cherubs, shall we? Uh, who to start with? The left or the right one? Let's start with the left one. Hello? Gucci, Gucci, Gucci. What do you want me to do? What can I get you? Uh, let's try the, um... Oh, look, look. It's a little princess on it, bless. There we go. Oh, she's... She likes that. This baby would like some music too. Not your style? Nope. Um, man and baby things don't really mix. What do you want me to do? What can I get you? Where's that pamphlet? Does your mind need stimulation? Are, are you hungry? Oh, 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 you smell like a circus. We should never have switched you over to Snoop Milk formula. Oh. Oh, do, do I? All right. I can do this. Ah, okay. Are you sure you're not awake, Valenis? <laughs> no, sleep to the world. You're right. I got this. <laughs> oh, we had to go with the cloth diapers. <laughs> yes, we did. All clean. How's it feel, bud? <laughs> well, that was oh, easy. Really? Oh dear, what does he want now? I know this might wake you, but I can't help myself. Mm. Oh, shh, 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 shh. Aww. Um, feeding, maybe? Feed? Our room is getting pretty crowded with all this baby stuff. They do look like bottles, so, uh... There you go. This bottle's pretty cold. And there is a... <laughs> and there is a fire here ready for us. It could be warmer. Do I wait? What, what do I do? Ah, perfect. Okay, so... Let's see if the little in is hungry. Down the hatch. I know. I'd rather have a burger, too. Yeah, I want a burger. No? How's, how's the other... How's the other little cherub? Oh, no. Wait, what? Can I... Sounds like a hungry cry. Can't... Oh. Ah. Aha. 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 Down the hatch. There we go. Just right. Ah, brilliant. All right, time for a burping. Ooh. Mm. 
Ooh, like a champ. Uh, of course. I can't wait till you're older, and we'll shoot our bows, and go on adventures, and we will all sleep through the night. <laughs> twins, right, they said. A barrel of laughs, they said. Well, they never tried putting twins to sleep. Okay. Um. So, so what would you I'm want, Lily? Lever and having the solution present itself. Where is the lever? Yeah, actually, that is a good point. Uh. Do okay, I... Prince. I have an idea. You have an idea. Oh, that worked. Ooh, what's this? I may be king, but you are my prince. Oh. Darn! Dude. Okay, just stand still. Just stand still. Don't do anything. Horse feathers! What? I have to move? Oh, what? Okay. I may be king. Let's try that what? again. What? 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 Am I failing? Why? Why am I failing? Let's see if I go. Just keep moving. I may be king, but you are my prince. If life gets too puzzling, I'll give you the hints. Your quest has begun, my kingdom you'll run. I'll love you forever, my son. You are my arrow, I am your bow. Guiding your shot on the journeys we'll go. We'll make lots of puns. No puzzles undone. I'll love you forever, my son. You're the treasure on my map. The feather in my cap. And when my beard grows grayer and frail, you'll tell my tale. If you sleep soundly and try not to wake, tomorrow I'll whip up a stack of pancakes. Choco chips by the ton. <laughs> we'll have so much fun. I'll love you forever, my son. Oh, well done. Woo, that was very nice. Oi, do I have something in my teeth? Why? Got a hot date? I might. I haven't asked her yet. Is this about Royal Guard number three again? Don't bother. I asked her out this morning and she said I wasn't her type. <laughs> mm, perhaps she's after a more muscular build. Like yourself? <laughs> Please, you look like a walking circus tent. Well, at least I don't dress like an upside-down lollipop. Your necklace is banal and trite. Your necklace is banal and trite. Well, you look like a trash can that swallowed a clown. I'd say you should be guarding a bridge, but that's offensive to the other trolls. I can hear every word, you know. I'm only six feet away. Zard. I thought she was royal guard number four. Still heard that? Sure. <laughs> they do know they're both dressed in the exact same getup, right? Last year's model. Not everyone can keep up with the latest fashion trends like us, Larry. Up top. Boom. But y you guys all look the same. Oh, dear. Did you hear that? Hear what? That. <laughs> oh, who's this delightful fellow? Immediately! Oh my goodness! Away, intruder! This is your last hat! <coughs> That's really showing him. <laughs> Good plan. But far 
Firing off. Move aside, bucketheads. Sheathe your swords, or die by them. Wait. Never. Not ever. Then take your move. Lock in. You're locked in. as well seed feast come back and fight me you coward Larry. he kind of already fought you sad sad face Larry he was a kind friend a good man but I never saw his face Raising these children will be our greatest adventure yet. I can't wait. Sweet dreams, love. Get the babies! Oh dear. Both dead. Oh, or maybe not? I wouldn't make any sudden moves if I was you. Manny? No. Only my friends call me that. You can address me by my full name. Mananan. What happened to you? Let's just say my mind outgrew my body. What do you want with me? <laughs> oh, Graham. Why is it always about you? Stay away from them! Shh! You wouldn't want to wake them. Not when they're sleeping so soundly. Hey there, little guy. You look like you could use a friend. You're the spitting image of your father. We can't be having that. <laughs> Don't you hurt him. What do you want? I'll do anything. What I want is for your family to feel the pain you humans brought on me. To know what it's like to be raised in a world that rejected you. And your child, this baby, this, uh, what's his name? <laughs> Alexander. A nice name. That just won't do. It's too regal and uninspired. How about Gwydion? Sounds more like a slave name, doesn't it? If you want the crown, take it. Just leave our babies alone. Don't fool yourself. I could snap my fingers right now and drop all of you dead. But what fun would that be? It certainly wouldn't be very kingly of me. No. Earn that crown you stole from me, Graham, by proving that I'm better than you. And perhaps with a more thoughtful father, this child could help inspire change. No, you can't. Don't worry. We'll be back one day to claim his birthright. And after our little Gwydion inherits the throne, he will better serve the needs of Daventry for all species. It won't work. I'll find you. Just try. No! 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 <laughs> I didn't know Graham wanted to be Darth Vader. Anyway. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. No one in Daventry would rest until Alexander was found. Alexander! Let's try and find... Alexander! Find little Alexander. 
Birds, get the message out. The prince has been kidnapped. He has indeed. By well, kind of the ripoff of Gargamel, but we'll we'll continue. Hello? Is anyone there? No. Unless you can speak to fish. Can you speak to fish? I don't think so. Have you seen the prince? Where have you taken my son? I don't think the bunny cares. Unfortunately. Alexander! Oh. Alexander! How, how about you two? Uh, you, you two seem a little uh, busy. I'll, I'll leave you alone. Alexander! Oh, this broke his heart. Any sign? The first 24 hours are the most critical. We need to search everywhere. Contact everyone. The trolls. The Goblin King. Message V. Have her search in the east. Yes, absolutely. If she would respond to my letters. What? Oh, what? never mind. We'll work that out later. I won't sleep until Alexander is back in our arms. I'll reach out to Queen Madeline. Her squirrels can cover ground quickly. Good plan. We looked up every tree and down every goblin hole, hoping for a sign or clue from our son. Yeah, yeah, that's right. You, that's right, love. You look in the cave. I'll look this way. Uh, every tree. Oh, hole. Every hole. Son, are you down there? No, Daddy, I'm not down here. Oh, okay, son. Wait a minute. Uh, Goblins? how's about this hole? You better not have him down there, for your sake. No, I don't think so. Tree. Coming down there. Oh, okay. Down the hole. Down the hole we go. I tore through that bedroom looking for any sign of my son. Uh, here? No. <laughs> Desperately looking. I don't really see him tearing anything up, do you? How's about this one? No, it can't go down that way. Anything else? I found a small sliver of hope. I will never stop looking. And we didn't. For 18 years, I never gave up hope. That is a long time to hold on to hope. It's time, dear. We've done all we can. Daventry needs you to get back to work. I'm not sure if I remember how. Oh. Come on, Dad. I'll help. Rosella had grown into a beautiful young lady. She was the perfect daughter. But it was hard for me to focus on anything knowing my family was incomplete. The Affordable Custard Initiative, really? That's the important paperwork crucial to Daventry's future? Yes. I'd rather be out searching for my son. Come now, dear. A spoonful of custard is the only joy some people get in this life. We have to break out of this funk. What about a vacation? The holiday's coming, and I've always wanted to visit the place where you met Mom. We have to get through all this paperwork first. Do you want me to whip up oh, some dear. chocolate chip pancakes? Uh, that Ooh. does sound good, actually. Perhaps for dinner. Oh, I know. Stand Agreed. Contest. <laughs> Those always cheer me up. Huh. I don't know. What's the matter? Afraid you might lose your undefeated record? Well, no, it's just... Too late. Davern Tree Decree P33P3R5 states that no one can deny a staring contest when challenged by the royal family. <laughs> <laughs> what? I knew that decree would backfire. <laughs> what was your fault for agreeing to it? You're pretty brave challenging your father to a staring contest. Ooh, okay, so is that a smirk? Nope. I just I have, have to keep 
Has anyone seen my keys? The cursor <gasps> in the middle of her face. Oh. <laughs> I see a smile. <laughs> oh! This beard covers all smiles. You will never win. I <laughs> <gasps> Have I ever told you? They call me Pockets, too. It's a family name. Oh, are your eyes getting heavy? No. Mm -hmm. No. P kinda. Oh my god, my eyes are hurting. Not funny. Oh, okay, my eyes are really starting to hurt. <laughs> okay, quick, quick, quick. Sardine smoothies, Frog Dog Fridays, Morphe's Itchy Back. Focus, Grant. You're slipping. You are not concentrating. Tickle fight. Oh, 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 oh cheater. Cheaters, both of you. <laughs> <gasps> Ooh, oh, yay. Uh, actually, my name is Gwydion. <gasps> what? Wait, he's... he came back? Oh, wow, okay. Just right from the heart, dear. Uh, I'm just having trouble seeing the point of all this. The words aren't coming. Oh, Graham. Since when have you had trouble finding words? Perhaps some popcorn-flavored jelly beans would help spark your imagination? Sorry, love. But I just don't have much of an appetite, not even for popcorn-flavored jelly beans. It was Aww. worth a shot. I thought Come it was pizza on, flavored. Let's bust out of here. Wouldn't you rather be on an adventure? We could take that trip to Kalima we've been talking about. That does sound lovely, but every moment with you is all the adventure I could ever hope for. It's best to take care of these things now. The doctors were pretty clear about that. It's time we tell Who's the that? children. I wonder who that could be. You called for me? Ah, uh, it's Gay Line. Yes. I mean, Gart. My father and <laughs> I have something we would like to tell you. You should probably take a seat. That's right. Sit down, Gay Lion. We we need to talk. Something serious, obviously. Ah, uh, follow me. I uh, uh, um. Hold on. Let me gather my thoughts. You know that I have had many great and fulfilling adventures. But there comes a time in every king's life when he must... when he must... There comes a time when every king must hand over his tasks to a worthy successor. And that's why I am giving you the very important job of filing this letter with the official court of amendments to addendums. I need some changes enacted immediately. Mm. Oh dear. Was that all? Yes. The changes outlined in the letter are critical to the well being of Daventry. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Sorry. And which addendum should this be filed under? Why, the number is on the front, of course. Addendum 48677. I see. Farewell, Grandpa. Ah, that sounds familiar. I think. I'm not sure, I could be just making up bullshit. <laughs> oh, gay lines disappointed about something. Gart, why haven't you been talking to me? What did I do? Oh. Sore loser. Ah. 
have a seat. Your grandma and I have something to tell you. <sighs> Not even sure a story could cheer me up. What's the matter, sweetheart? It's Gart. He hasn't said one word to me for three days. He lost in our game of wits, but I don't think that's what's bothering him. He's just been so cold and distant lately. I'm sure whatever it is will pass. The bonds of a strong family like ours are not easily broken. Actually, that does remind me of a story. Of I course it does. In a while. And interestingly enough... Go ahead. Interestingly <laughs> enough, it's about your father. It's about your daddy. We were in the middle of a very cold winter, and Alexander was having a hard time adjusting to the life of a royal. So we decided the best thing for everybody was to take a family vacation to Avalon. Oh, oh that is a... Thought you fell in love with Grandma. Yes, and the weather was much sunnier there this time of year. It would be a great opportunity to get to know my son. I had a thousand questions about how he escaped Mananan, but I didn't want to bombard him all at once. So, son, I thought perhaps we'd make a little detour so I could share one of my favorite spots. Sounds good to me. I do have one tiny request, though. Anything for my Alexander? Yeah, it's, um, <clears throat> it's that name. Uh. You don't want to be called Gwydion, do you? Oh, no, no, no. It, it's just, I figured since I have to learn a new name anyway, why not pick something with a little more spark in it? You know, something with a little mystery? Something mm, like, okay. I don't know. Caduceus the Magnificent! <laughs> yeah, I always <laughs> love that name. Um, you actually want to be called Caduceus? I mean, it's just a thought. More like a dream. Well, it's... Not a very princely name, but w we can talk about it. Really? Now, what to show you first? <laughs> Caduceus. <laughs> but anyway, sorry. Um. Anyways, I, I was uh I was saying before you know um you know I didn't want to interrupt the game. That was a lot of me saying you know. Uh, that's very nice of him, you know, trying to get to know the son that he hasn't seen for 18 years, you know, family vacation, it's, it's very nice. But anyway guys, I am gonna stop it here, it is a long episode, I hope you guys have enjoyed, I will try and record uh, more stuff as possible, um, if I get the time, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you then. Bye-bye!